How doth the little crocodile improve his shining tail? And pour the waters of the Nile on every golden scale. How cheerfully he seems to grin, how neatly spread his claws. And welcome little fishes in with gently smiling jaws. Said to a mouse that he met in the house, let us both go to law. I will prosecute you. Come, I'll take no denial. You must have a trial. For really, this morning I've nothing to do, said the mouse to the cur. Such a trial, dear sir. No jury or judge would be wasting our breath I'll be judge, I'll be jury Said cunning old fury I'll try the whole cause And condemn you to death Our old father William the young man said your hair has become very white And yet you incessantly stand on your head Do you think at your age it is right? In my youth Father William replied to his son I feared it might injure the brain But now that I am perfectly sure I have none why I do it again and again You are old, said the youth, as I mentioned before And have grown most uncommonly fat Yet you turned back somersault in at the door Pray what is the reason of that? In my youth, said the sage, as he shook his grey locks I kept all my limbs very supple By the use of this ointment One shilling the box Allow me to sell you a couple In my youth said the sage As he shook his grey locks I kept all my limbs very supple By the use of this ointment One shilling the box Allow me to sell you a couple You are old, said the youth And your jaws are too weak For anything tougher than suit Yet you finish the goose With the bones and the beak Pray how did you manage to do it In my youth, said his father I took to the law Argued each case with my wife And the muscular strength which it gave to my jaw Has lasted the rest of my life You are old, said the youth One would hardly suppose that your eye was as steady as ever Yet you bounced an eel on the end of your nose what made you so awfully clever? I have answered three questions and that is enough Said his father, don't give yourself airs Do you think I can listen all day to such stuff? Be off or I'll send you downstairs Speak roughly to your little boy And beat him when he sneezes 
He only does it to annoy Because he knows it teases Wow, 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 wow I speak severely to my boy I beat him when he sneezes For he can thoroughly enjoy The pepper when he pleases Wow, 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 wow Up above the world you fly Like a tea tray in the sky Twinkle, twinkle Twinkle, 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 twinkle Twinkle, twinkle To a snail There's a porpoise close behind us And he's treading on my tail See how eagerly the lobsters And the turtles all advance They are waiting on the shingle Will you come and join the dance Will you, won't you, will you, won't you Will you join the dance Will you, won't you, will you, won't you Will you join the dance You can really have no notion How delightful it will be when they take us up and throw us with the lobsters out to sea But the snail replied too far, too far and gave a look askance Say he thanked the white kindly but he would not join the dance Would not, could not, would not, could not, would not join the dance Would not, could not, would not join the dance What matters it how far we go, his scaly friend replied there is another shore, you know, on the other side The further off from England, the nearer is to France Then turn not and hail, beloved snail Come and join the dance But will you, won't you, won't you Will you join the dance? Will you, won't you, won't you Join the dance? Will you, won't you, will you, won't you Will you join the dance? Will you, won't you garden and marked with one eye how the owl and the panther were sharing a pie the panther took pie crust and gravy and meat 
While the owl had the dish as its share of the treat When the pie was all finished The owl as a boon Was kindly permitted to pocket the spoon While the panther received knife and fought with a growl and concluded the banquet. Beautiful soup, so rich and green, waiting in a hot terrain. Who for such dainties would not stoop? Soup of the Dish. Who would not give all else for to be any worth only a beautiful soup? Any worth only a beautiful soup? Talks all on a summer day. The naval hearts, he stole those tarts and took them quite away. The queen of hearts, she made some tarts all on a summer day. The naval hearts, he stole those tarts and took them quite away. Chance to be involved in this affair. 
trust to you to set them free exactly as we were. My notion was that you had been before she had this fit. An obstacle that came between him and ourselves and it Don't let him know she liked them best For this must ever be A secret kept from all the rest Between yourself and me Sword in hand, long time the man's and foe he saw. So rested he by the tum tum tree and stood a while in thought. And as he knew a fish thought he stood, the Jabberwock with eyes of flame came whiffling through the tall G wood and burbled as it came. One, two, one, two, and through and through the vocal blade went snicker snack. He left it dead, and with his head, he went galumphing back. And hast thou slain the Jabberwock? Come to my arms, my beamish boy, O fragile day. Kalu, Kale, he chortled in his joy. T'was brilliant, and the slimy toes did gyre and gimble in the way. All mimsy were the borogos and the moan rafts out Spoiled his nice new rattle 
Just then flew down a monstrous crow As black as a tar barrel Which frightened both the heroes So they quite forgot their quarrel Just then flew down a monstrous crow As black as a tar barrel Which frightened both the heroes So they quite forgot their quarrel Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall Humpty Dumpty had a great fall All the king's horses and all the king's men Couldn't put Humpty Dumpty in his place again The sun was shining on the sea Shining with all his might He did his very best to make The billows smooth and bright and this was odd because it was the middle of the night The moon was shining sulkily Because she thought the sun had got no business to be there After day was done it's very rude of him She said to come and spoil the fun The sea was wet as wet could be The sands were dry as dry you could not see a cloud because no cloud was in the sky No birds were flying overhead, there were no birds to fly The walrus and the carpenter were walking close at hand They wept like anything to see such quantities of sand If this were only cleared away, they said it would be grand if seven maids with seven mops swept it for half a year Do you suppose the walrus said that they could get it clear? I doubt it said the carpenter And shed a bitter tear Oh oysters come and walk with us The walrus did beseech A pleasant walk, a pleasant talk Along the briny beach We cannot do with more than four to give a hand to each Oh, oysters, come and walk with us The walrus did beseech A pleasant walk, a pleasant talk Along the briny beach We cannot do with more than four to give a hand to each The eldest oyster looked at him But never a word he said The eldest oyster winked his eye And shook his heavy head Meaning to say he did not choose to leave the oyster bed But four young oysters hurried up All eager for the treat Their coats were brushed, their faces washed Their shoes were clean and neat And this was odd because you know they hadn't any feet Four other oysters followed them And yet another four And thick and fast they came at last And more and more and more and more All hopping through the frothy waves And scrambling to the shore The walrus and the carpenter Walked on a mile or so And then they rested on a rock Conveniently low And all the little oysters stood and waited in the time has come, the war is said To talk of many things, of shoes and ships and sealing wax Of cabbages and kings and why the sea is boiling hot And whether pigs have wings 
But wait a bit, the oysters cried Before we'd have our chat For some of us are out of breath And all of us are fat No hurry, said the carpenter They thanked him much for that A loaf of bread, the walrus said But we chiefly need pepper and vinegar Besides are very good indeed Now if you're ready, oysters dear We can begin to feed But not on us the oysters cry, turning a little blue After such kindness, that would be a dismal thing to do The night is fine, the walrus said, do you admire the view? It was so kind of you to come, you are very nice The carpenter said nothing but cut us another slice I wish you were not quite so deaf, I had to ask you twice Seems a shame the war is said to play them such a trick After we brought them out so far and made them trot so quick The carpenter said nothing but the butter spread too thick I weep for you, the war is said, I deeply sympathize With sobs and tears he sorted out those of the largest size Holding his pocket handkerchief for his streaming eyes Oysters said the carpenter, you've had a pleasant run Shall we be trotting home again? But answer came there none And that was scarcely odd, because they'd eaten everyone In winter, when the fields are white, I'll sing this song for your delight In spring, when the woods are getting green, I'll try and tell you what I mean In summer, when the days are long Perhaps you'll understand the song In autumn when the leaves are brown Take pen and ink and write it down I sent a message to the fish I told them this is what I wish The little fishes of the sea They sent an answer back to me The little fish's answer was We cannot do it sir Because I sent to them again to say It will be better to obey the fishes answered with a grin Why, what a temper you are in I told them once, I told them twice They would not listen to advice I took a kettle large and new Fit for the deed I had to do My heart went hot, my heart went thump I filled the kettle at the pump Then someone came to me and said The little fishes are in bed I said to him, I said it plain, then you must wake them up again I said it very loud and clear, I went and shouted in his ear But he was very stiff and proud, he said you needn't shout so loud But he was very proud and stiff he said I'd go and wake them if I took a corkscrew from the shelf I went to wake them up myself and when I found the door was locked I pulled and pushed and kicked and knocked and when I found the door was shut I tried to turn the handle but a fish's answer or I found the door was locked I pulled and pushed and kicked and knocked And when I found the door was shut I tried to turn the handle but Fish's answer or I found the door was locked I pulled and pushed and kicked and knocked And when I found the door was shut I tried to turn the handle but Fish's answer or a farm, a farm. The lion and the unicorn were fighting for the crown The lion beat the unicorn all round the town Some gave them white bread, some gave them brown some gave them plum cake and drum them out of town I'll tell thee everything I can There's little to relate I saw an aged aged man A sitting on a gate Who are you aged man I said And how is it you live and his answer trickled through my head like water through a sieve. He said, I look for butterflies that sleep among the wheat. 
I make them into mutton pies and sell them in the street. I sell them on to many set who sail on stormy seas. And that's the way I get my bread a trifle, if you please. But I was thinking of a plan to dye one's whiskers green. And always you so large a fan that they could not be seen So having no reply again to what the old man said I cried, come tell me how you live and thumped him on the head His accent's mild to cut the tail, he said I go my way and when I find the mountain rill, I set it in a blaze. And thence they make a stuff they call Roland's Macassar oil. Yet twopence half beneath all they give me for my toil. Sometimes dig for buttered rolls Or set live twigs for crabs I sometimes search the grassy knolls For wheels of hunts and cows And that's the way he gave a wink By which I get my wealth And very gladly will I drink Your honor's noble health I heard him then For I had just completed my design to keep the Menai bridge from rust by boiling it in wine. I thanked him much for telling me the way he got his wealth, but chiefly for his wish that he might drink my noble health. And now if there by chance I put my fingers into glue, or madly squeeze a right hand foot into a left hand shoe, or if I drop upon my toe a very heavy weight I weep for it reminds me so of that old man I used to know Whose look was mild, whose speech was slow, whose hair was whiter than the snow Whose face was very like a crow With eyes like cinders all aglow Who seemed distracted with his woe Rocked it mumblingly and low As if his mouth were full of dough Snorted like a buffalo That summer evening long ago Sitting on the gate Rush the bar lady in Alice's lap Till the feast is ready with time for a nap When the feast is over we'll go to the ball Red Queen and White Queen and Alice and all To the looking glass world it was Alice that said I have a scepter in hand, I have a crown on my head Let the looking glass creatures, whatever they be Come and dine with the Red Queen, the White Queen and me Then fill up the glasses as quick as you can and sprinkle the table with buttons and bran Put cats in the coffee and mice in the tea And welcome Queen Alice with 30 
many times three Oh, looking glass creatures Quoth Alice, draw near Tis an honor to see me Favored to hear Tis a privilege high To have dinner and tea Along with the Red Queen The White Queen and me Then fill up the glasses With treacle and ink or anything else that is pleasant to drink Mix and with the cider and war with the wine And welcome Queen Alice with 90 times 9 Then fill up the glasses with treacle and ink Or anything else that is pleasant to drink Sand with the cider and wool with the wine And world Queen Alice with ninety times nine As the fish must be caught That is easy Baby I think could have caught it Next the fish must be bought That is easy Penny I think would have bought it Now cook me the fish that is easy And will not take more than a minute let it lie in a dish that is easy Because it already is in it Bring it here, let me suck It is easy Set such a dish on the table Take the dish cover up Ah, that is so hard that I feel I'm unable for it holds it like glue Holds the lid to the dish While it lies in the middle Which is easiest to do One dish cover the fish Or dish cover the riddle sunny sky lingering onward dreamily in an evening of July children free that nestle near eager I and willing here pleased a simple tale to hear Long has paled that sunny sky Echoes fade and memories die Autumn frost is slain July Still she haunts me phantom-wise Alice moving under skies Never seen by waking eyes Children yet the tale to hear Eager I and willing you Lovingly shall nestle near In a wonderland they lie Dreaming as the days go by Dreaming as the summers die Ever drifting down the stream Lingering in the golden gleam Life, what is it but a dream? 